Just three days after the two Koreas reached a landmark agreement, North Korean leader Kim Jong-un spoke about the importance of staying committed to the deal. Our Hwang sung yi tells us what Kim's latest comments may mean for inter-Korean relations. North Korean leader Kim Jong-un hailed the new inter-Korean agreement, calling it a landmark occasion that could be a crucial turning point for the Koreas. The joint press release published at the contact provided a crucial landmark occasion of diffusing the acute military tension and putting the catastrophic inter-Korean relations on the track of reconciliation and trust. The remark, made at a recent Workers' Party meeting, comes three days after the Koreas reached the agreement. It also follows similar comments made by senior North Korean officials Hwang byung seo who said it's a relief that the two sides created a new mood for improving ties, and Kim Yang-gun, who stressed the importance of advancing towards reunification. Analysts say the string of publicity about the agreement is significant and expect Pyongyang to take aggressive steps to advance inter-Korean ties in line with its commitment. On Friday, South Korea welcomed the young leader's remarks but said the North must put its words into action. We expect North Korea to abide by the accord that it agreed to and urge it to faithfully implement it. At the same party meeting, the North Korean media reported Kim sacked several top officials of the regime's Central Military Commission. The reasons for the dismissals remain unknown, but analysts said it could be linked to the landmine explosions at the demilitarized zone that led to South Korea's strong response. They said the sacked officials may have been held responsible for allowing the latest confrontation to nearly spin out of control. Hwang Sang-hee, Arirang News.